All right, good day, everybody. Welcome to today's video. Today's video, I'm going to show you a quick and dirty method and how you could check this chain stretch on your MP231 or 241, whatever transfer case you got that uses a chain without physically taking it apart or removing the drain plug and seeing how much that you can push the chain up. This method is relatively pretty simple. It'll kind of give you a good idea. So to understand how this works, I'm going to go over the theory with you. So on my whiteboard, I just kind of drew, so in your transfer case, there'll be two gears that have the chain. So it doesn't matter if you're going forward or reverse, one side of the chain is going to be loaded and one side is going to be unloaded. So the top side is going to be tight and then the bottom is going to be where all the slack is. Make sure the back ends on the ground, wheels chalked, emergency brake on. Because with the wheels up in the air, what you're going to do is turn the drive shaft the opposite way and you're going to take up the slack. And then if you go the other way, you're going to wind it up. And that's how that's going to work. So basically, if you can get underneath and you can get a quarter turn out of your drive shaft, out of the front yoke, that's a pretty good chance that your transfer case chain is stretched. So as you can see, that tire's free. That tire's free. Let's crawl underneath. Don't trip on the light. Now what I got is a brand new chain on my transfer case. You're going to need to get some light on the subject so you guys can see what's going on. You're gonna need to shift it into four wheel drive for this to work. In four wheel drive, I am going to grab the front yoke and try to take up the slack. And as you can see, I got like no movement. Put the light over here so it's a little better. You also see in the rear drive shaft too that uh, there's a little bit of play, but that's actually really tight. So if you had a chain that was stretched, you'd probably get possibly like a quarter turn out of that yoke. So if you have any doubts whether or not your transfer case chain is any good or not, this is the quickest, easiest, dirtiest method to go underneath and kind of give you an idea how much stretch is in your transfer case chain. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, post them below. And I'll see you guys in the next one.